Hi there YouTube, this is GSX Graphics here and today I'm going to be teaching you how to do 3D glossy um, effect in Cinema 4D. So first of all you're going to want to open up MoGraph and then MoText. So just do your text. You're going to want to make the text what you like. I'm just going to put it Tutorial. Change the depth to 100. Put it in the middle, go to align, put it in the middle, put it to whatever font you'd like. I'm just I'm gonna use Devil Breeze and I'll send you a link of how to get it. Okay. Um first and then what you want to do is you want to go over to the the rendering settings. You're gonna want to say you're gonna want to go to output you're going to want to go to this then to film and video and then you're going to want to go down to HDV HTTV this one and you click on that one then go to save save as what you like I'm just going to save as tutorial and then you, the format PNG and if you're doing a background um, tick alpha channel if not then don't tick it and back out of that then go to over to caps and then start you're going to want to make fill it cap and you're going to want to put the radius down to three centimeters okay once you've done that you're going to want to um, you're going to want to go to window then you're going to want to go to content browser and then what you're going to want to do is I'll put a link in the description on of how to get this grayscale gorilla light pro if you know how if you have it you're going to want to open up the overhead box soft box and the ring light then you're going to want to back out of this you're going to want to zoom out Ooh. Sorry about this. And you want gonna go want to go over to the overhead softbox, and you're gonna want to click Control C, Control V, and w click on that, and go to chord. And then you're gonna want to bring it. You want to go to P, and you're gonna want to make it come down. But I say put it on for 38. 38, 39, and then you're gonna, gonna go to Y, bring it up a bit, and as you can see here, got it, and it's nice and thingy. And then what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna, I'm going to put a link in the description also to a material pack. This is very, very good. And then wait a sec. All right, when you've opened up this, you're gonna want to uh, go to Chrome. You're gonna want to put it on, and you're gonna want to go to Tag Selection, and you're gonna want to do. Um, you want to put Caps Lock on and do R. One, press enter, and then you're going to want to go whatever color you want. So I'm just going to go with a nice shiny blue. Yep. And then you're go all you're going to want to do is you want to go to your rendering settings, just render it, and there you go. You have glossy effect. I hope you've um enjoy the tutorial and I hope this has helped you uh, please comment rate and subscribe I really need subscribers um, I'll put you in my sub box first 10 subscribers um, yeah have a nice day um, see you guys